Sticking in Statesboro here, Tormenta FC players and coaches tell me after two ties to start the season, they felt like they maybe could have won those games and they were knocking on the door of a win. They got a golden opportunity to do it on Saturday night. Third straight home game for the guys. The team they're playing hasn't played a single game yet this year. So Tormenta can maybe jump on Orlando City B early, maybe knock in a quick goal like they did in the season opener. Let me tell you, they certainly tried. Great ball in. Tormenta gets ahead on it. Unfortunately, the keeper's right there to corral it in. Coach saying, hey, let's keep our foot on the gas pedal here in the first half. Luca Meyer listened, showed why he was so dangerous with the second team last year, dancing around defenders, and that's a superhuman effort from the keep to keep this one out. Towards the end of halftime, Tormenta trying to sneak one in. Here's Pato, and his deflection scoots just outside the post, so we'd go into halftime tied. But then we saw an absolute stunner from Nil Vignols here in the second half. From outside the 18, catches a little iron on the way in. That's going to count. A beauty of a goal. He'd score another one a few minutes later. So you can put it on the board. Tormenta wins its first game of 2020. Okay, so Tormenta has played three games so far, and here's where they sit in the USL League One standings. That win was huge this early in the year. They're right behind Greenville Triumph, and Tormenta could actually take first place with a win Wednesday because they hit the road to take on that Triumph team.